In the time before the Titans, before the gods of Olympus, a great battle was waged. Hello there, Sarah from 17 once again. This is my God of War Ascension Titan difficulty video walkthrough. This is the Lantern. Lantern? That's not true. This is the Lantern of Delos. These chests here are worth using because they will come back, I believe. Uh, that being said, I don't think these chests come back. I think it's the fact that the next room is identical and they have chests too. So do not quote me on that. Uh, all I'm saying is the Trial of Archimedes is coming up because this is a very short level and you at least want to go into this trial with full life. If you don't, good for you, but you're going to have to play better. And that's, that is the case. Uh, what is about to take place is a, a small endurance fight that a lot of players have complained about. The first phase is, I think it's about four to six Gorgons, uh, two at a time, and then two Sirens with the Gorgons. So you're going to take on two Gorgons, and then when the next two Gorgons turn up, I think the Sirens turn up. Uh, you'll, you'll see it in the next video. I'm just going to give you a little layout of, of what's going to happen, because there's nothing much in this video. It's just a little bit of puzzle-solving-esque stuff. And... Uh, once you once you kill those, you do not get a checkpoint or a healing item in between that moment and the next. And the next wave is going to be a very restricted room with fire coming out of the walls at a certain duration. There's going to be a bunch of harpies, there's going to be an Amazonian woman, and there's going to be uh, a hammer guy, one of the elemental hammer guys. And you can block everything each of these things do except for the magic spell that the hammer guy does when he gets really angry and he kind of explodes. Uh, if you do that, you'll go on to the third phase, which is the easiest phase, which is a fight with a, a, a centaur, and the platform's gradually getting smaller, but it's, it's, you've got more than enough time, so don't even worry about that. The centaur is easy, you keep your distance, he runs at you, you take him out, so on and so forth. And then the final phase is a handful of wraiths, which can be dangerous, do a lot of damage, but once again, they're not that bad at all. You have to do all of it without a checkpoint, without a heal, so you at least have to be quite comfortable with the concept of this being a tough fight. If you can do that, you're going to have no trouble whatsoever. You might even do it on your first attempt. I did it on my second and the only reason I didn't do it on my first is because I had a glitch where the game didn't script the enemy to, to drop down. So when I killed the Harpies and the Amazonian lady, the hammer guy never came, the fire kept coming out of the walls, and I was there for about two or three minutes and I had to restart the checkpoint. That I know that sounds terrifying on, on such a challenging section, but don't worry. If you struggled on hard, I guarantee you, you will have a better time on Titan just because you're a better player. And if you struggle on, on whatever difficulty you're on, by the time you do beat it, you're going to be a lot more comfortable with it than you were before. So it's a win-win both ways. Just don't think, you know, don't worry about it. It's not that bad. But you'll see in the next video how it, how it is. So thanks for watching, and you take care now.